Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we encounter a frauditor who goes by the name Truthaholic. And it seems to be his goal in life to cause problems rather than solve them. So let's sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Folks, Truthaholic, out in Hancock, Michigan, almost Finlandia University. Not much going on, though, in this town. I mean, it's a nice little town, actually. Fifteen minutes later. City of Hancock City Hall and their police department. Do you see any signage that says, here's reserved parking for handicap? Do you see any thing on the building that says, uh, restricted parking, uh, restricted personnel? Now they got the computer closed, which is good. Looking at here, Fords, police station uses Fords. That's pretty common. No restricted parking, no restricted access. Let's see what this sign says no parking, police cars. It doesn't matter what the signs say, because you'll do the exact opposite anyway. Okay. Let's go on in and see what we can see. Here's a map. How you doing? Doing all right, say, how are you doing? What's happening today? Making friends again? Yeah, just checking out the building. Again, you probably got them all recorded many times already. I haven't, actually. <laughs> I haven't. Today is going to be official one. But actually, you shouldn't, be, you shouldn't be recording in a police department. Yeah? Right. That's a public building and you're recording. Yeah, well, you? it's a police department, you know. It's, Still. There's, sec there's security concerns there. Well, I guess you'll have to do what you got to do if you think you need to pursue well, that. It sounds like he's been here multiple times doing this. Is he trying to get arrested? Already in the police department is what I'm asking you. Well, will you turn your camera off, please? Our cameras are security cameras. I know, but the, the right that gives you the privilege to to invade my privacy is the same right that protects my ability to You're record. Invading your privacy? You walked in here. I know. Well, if you have a problem with it, then you're going to have to deal with it. If you want to, you want to arrest me? Well, I'm going to ask you just to leave our office then. I will when I'm done. I'm conducting a, some business here. What's your business here? I'm doing a story on the Hancock Police Station. Okay. Liar! Come on, frauditor. F stop following the same script that every other frauditor does. Do something creative for once. It's going to take me about a few minutes, so... Uh, I know that I can't go past. You, want, you just keep trying to do this agitating stuff. Is that right? what you, you want to call it? Do this discussion how many times, right? Is that what you want to call it? Wasn't that what it is? So I'm, I'm prompting you to be agitated. Why can't you just do no, it right? looking for reactions everywhere you go with that thing in everybody's face. That's the reactions you're looking for. Oh, right? okay. Right? No, that's not what I'm doing. I'm expecting you to uphold your oath and to be respectful and to I realize respectful. that. I don't like the thought of you coming in here for our security in, in here recording everything in, in the police department, right? So you don't understand what the plain view doctrine is? That whatever I can see, you can't trespass my eyes? Oh my god, Frauditor! You are just following the script to the letter. You're nothing more than a sheep at this point. You won't even bother to do the simplest bit of research. Hell, you might as well change your name to Sheep Show. Because I know he's just as much of a sycophantic jack wagon as you are. Okay, well you can see he recorded it, now you can leave, right? When I'm done, I'm not done narrating my video. In fact, um, I might do be doing a FOIA request, the Freedom of Information Act. On what? On all the employees, the names and salaries of everybody that works in this, in this department. 
Oh, you can do that. Sure. Do would I do that through you here, or would I go upstairs? Yes, you do it through the through the uh, okay. city offices. See how you got defensive and you're kind of harassing me today. I'm not I mean, harassing this, you. This is like the fifth time you come in here and done the same thing. I don't know how much video you think you. Did I've here. been in here twice with this camera. I've talked to you personally here. I've only at least been three times. I've been in here twice with this camera. And Maybe the, you got a new camera then. I don't. No, know. the only time I came in last time because Becky um, gave me har harassed me, and I wanted to address that. That's the only time I've been in here with this camera. I've never seen any of the things that you guys got going in here, and. Uh, when I'm done, I'll, I'll take off. So I just want you to under, understand that I have a right to do this legally and you can't stop me from doing this. Once again, you prove how wrong you are. Michigan trespassing law says otherwise. Which continues to show all you're doing is following the standard fraud under script and doing absolutely no research whatsoever. Thus proving once again that you are nothing more than a sheep. So you don't make any sense to me. It doesn't even make any sense what you do, other than other than you're looking for a reaction out of people. Well, I'm sorry you feel that way, but well, I'm, I think ninety-nine percent of the population will feel that way. I don't think so. Why? Well, you have a camera there, and you can do that legally. Our cameras are security cameras. I know, yes. but you're protected for a particular reason. Why are you allowed to do that? Why are we allowed to protect? Yeah. Yeah. Well, why sense. why can I not have you turn that camera off? Because you you can't. I know, and just the same with this camera. You can't do the same with this camera either. Well, I'll I'll, I'll, talk, I'll look up some legal yeah protocol on, on you do that on government buildings. You I do that. There is prohib prohibit look it up stuff where you can look it up. It. If you want me to come back and we can test it again next time. I don't need to come back. I can look it up without you. I know, but. But I'm sure you'll come back anyway, because that's no. The way you I are, don't necessarily right? need to come back. I mean, what you're doing is that you're failing at what, what you're called to do. You're called to be respectful and to treat the public and, and honor you. And we've done this how many times? Very respectfully, right? One time I've but been you in here with the camera. Coming back and coming back and coming I've been back. in your office and one time. There's nothing new. Every time you come back, it's the same old spiel. So that means that you want to throw me out then? No, it means you're wasting everybody's time. Oh, right. How many times do we get calls on you? I don't know how many have Once. I and I ever broken the law once. How many times have we had to come figure out? We get calls on suspicious people, and it's always you. Right, and and that's what I mean. That's there's an education process. So are we that not supposed occurred. to respond, or what is that? No, what you're mean? you're supposed to respond, but you're supposed to be become educated and learn that this guy is not doing anything wrong. Well, and we don't know that until we get there, right? Right, and then that's okay. your job. But you're. Wait, how much time are you tying up on our on us then to come and figure this out? So every time that I've been out here, I've never done it without a sign. Right. I mean, I've I've always had the signs. So you know, I, I do have a busy day. That's why I'm having this abrupt conversation. Well, you, you can go do your job. I gotta do. Okay. Okay. You can go to work. Right. Dumbass! You dumbass! You're a dumbass! Such a dumbass! You're an ass. Have a good one. Because it's the same conversation every time we talk. No, you you you're closed-minded, officer. Okay. Not much to see here, really, but. They have their cameras here. Here's the thin blue line gang sign. To get a reaction, isn't that weird? To get a reaction. Well, all you gotta do is act lawfully and you won't be reacting in a way that's embarrassing to yourself okay looks like he he failed today out and then failed me and him have had cord, cordial conversations probably three or four times he's right in stating that but it's always been that somebody had called the police on me. well now there you have it Another imbecile level frauditor of only following a script and has nothing original to say. And if he continues to follow the script, he's going to end up in the back of a squad car. Oh, how I would love to see that.